Hey everyone, in this episode I'm going to show you our German coins collection. Among them you will see old and relatively modern coins issued within a span of more than 100 years. So hit subscribe button below this video if you haven't done it yet and let's get started. This is 1928 10 Reichspfennig with mint mark A which stands for Berlin Statement. Oversight features wheat ears forming a shape of pyramid. Mint mark A on the top and the date below. On the reverse we see denomination in square with oak leaves, legends around Deutsch Reich meaning German Empire. And face value struck during period of Weimar Republic this coin was in general circulation until 1936. Content of a metal is aluminium bronze alloy. Coin is in extremely fine condition notwithstanding failings on reverse and averse. Slight softness seen on higher points of device and some on the date. According to NGC price guide 1928 A's, even at lowest mean state, that is MS60, are worth at least $75. You'll be surprised, but those with mint mark G, Karl's Ruhe mint, are at least 10 times more expensive than those with mint mark A, worth at least $700. Continue with this old Austrian coin, 1894 10 Heller, featuring the double-headed imperial eagle with, with Habsburg, Lorraine shield on reverse and denomination and year of minting with an ornate shield on reverse. Nickel coin with weight of 3 grams, mintage is over 45 million examples struck. Therefore, easily located coins worth less than $4 at means day 60. Our specimen is at very fine condition and can be fetched for two to three dollars on eBay. This issue was in circulation until 1911. Yet another Austrian coin, 1915 10 Heller. Here also we have Habsburg coat of arms on obverse, but on the reverse beautifully wreathed denomination with date. Metal composition of this one is copper nickel zinc alloy, ages rated. Production of this issue had been discontinued after the next year, that's 1916. As you can see surfaces are neatly preserved on both sides. Strike is bold with some sharply detailed motifs on the shield of the eagle breast. Coin is void of large distractions and or tarnished surfaces. Surfaces are untoned. The mintage of this coin is over 80 million, yet also worth between three four dollars at lower uncirculated grades. At mid day 63, worth over ten dollars. This is 1989 Tem Fennig from Germany with meat mark F. Circulated brass clad steel coins with weight of four grams. Meat mark F stands for Stuttgart Mint of Germany. Coin is devoid of original mint luster. Some areas developed toned surfaces accompanied with slight tarnish around the letterings and device elements. At lowest mint state, these Stuttgart struck fennigs are worth less than 10 cents. At highest mint state available, worth around $25. Here is 1988 5 Fennig with mint mark G. G stands for Karlsruhe mint. Metal composition is the same but as clearly seen, lower denomination have smaller diameter. In 1988 Karlsruhe mint produced over 41 million of these, so not rare coin at all. At highest mint state available worth just around $25 according to NGC price guide. This, this one is at very fine condition, featuring crimson red, burnt orange hues over large numeral 5 and some unpleasant dark stocks near the edge. Wear is limited to minimum though, all letterings are readable. Next, 1982 Pfennig with meat mark D. D stands for Munich Mint. Generally, these two fennigs have two varieties, mag magnetic and non-magnetic. Non-magnetic ones are those struck from bronze planchette. I checked this one and it did not stick to the magnets, thereby 
It is copper class steel variant. Heavily circulated coin with some verdigris on upper surfaces around the collar. Medium rub is evident on high points of device elements, surfaces of which are totally void of luster. Mintage is over 52 million samples struck, therefore worth less than 5 cents at mint state 60. At mint state 69, just one point lacking absolute perfection. They're worth over $15. And the smallest denomination German coin 1993 one pfennig also struck by Munich Mint. This one has seen many pockets, where is minimal yet, dark freckles are spotted on many areas. For comparison of diameters, let me show you it side by side with this 10 pfennig. Moving on to the 1969 Tempfennig from Democratic Republic of Germany. The obverse side depicts the emblem of GDR, hammer and a compass surrounded by wreaths of ears with a ribbon. Brass coin with weight of 5.4 grams. The first year of issue. In 1969 Berlin Mint struck more than 167 million of such coins. At mint stage 60 they are worth $1, at mint stage 63 is $3. At mint stage 65, around $7. 1955 Deutsche Mark with mint mark F standing for Stuttgart mint. Coin is slightly tarnished. 1955 F comes with mintage of only 4 million, therefore they are sorted and circulated grades. At mint stage 63, which is relatively lower on circulated grades, these coins are worth over $500. Moving on to this 1982 Deutsche Mark, surfaces are massively abraded as you can see, light wear is evident on high points, comes with mint mark F which stands for Stuttgart mint, that superb gem condition worth just $25 as for NGC price guide. Here is 1972 Deutsche Mark at very fine condition, light wear is seen on high points, oversight displays is long curvy goats all over the surfaces accompanied with this gigantic nick at 8 o'clock. Worth just $10 at mint stage 63. Next comes is 1992 Deutsche Mark, also copper nickel content. This one comes with mint mark J, which stands for Hamburgische Münze Mint. On the obverse under the eagle, some mustard yellow olive green hues catch the eye. Mintage is more than 31 million. Continuing with this splendid 50 Fennig minted in 1989 by Hamburgische Minze Mint. Metal composition is 75% copper, 25% nickel. Oversight depicts a woman planting an oak, symbolizing Germany's rebirth after war. Worth just $1, even at mint state 63. And for the last is 1988 5 Deutsche Mark with mint mark D which stands for Munich Mint, heavily circulated coin with post-mint modification, someone tried to inscribe his name on it, seemingly, here above the German eagle. Copper nickel clad coin with weight of 10 grams, worth around 5-10 dollars at lower uncirculated grades. So guys, if you have one of these coins, you can easily post them for sale on our website, thecoinas.com. For latest numismatic news, check out our new website, thecoinsas.com, with S in the middle. Take care.